This is Andreas putting in the last bit of air into our 820, what are they, 24s? 824s by 9 tires. They weigh about 300 pounds a piece, and with the wheels, our wooden artillery wheels, are just absolutely unbelievable. This took four hours plus, just an hour a wheel. That's, they're absolutely unbelievable. They're so big. And uh, you can get an idea how big they are. I'm going to walk in the other room and just show you some other. Smile, Andreas. This could be worse. <laughs> We're going to no, go I have a. Think you can. <laughs> yeah. We're going to go have a very large drink in a few minutes. But anyhow, let me just take you in here and show you. This is what they fit on. These are the smaller tires. Those are the 700s. What we just put on and mounted is the 800s. And you can see how big these damn things are. That's a regular seven foot file cabinet and it's halfway up. They are very, very large. Anyhow, this is our little shop at the moment. It's a, kind of got a bunch of things in it. This one here, which is a, just a little 14 liter chain drive monster that we're doing. We've got to put the wooden boat deck on that. And this is a 1938 three and a half or four and a quarter liter Bentley special that we're doing. And then of course GRO 63 and GM 07 our boat tail speedster Rolls Royces which we have now shown six times and won six times. It's very very nice. The last one was this weekend I was in Seattle Washington for a beef eater banquet and Andreas and Marilyn and another friend Terry Sec took the cars to Santa Barbara and we won a major award there. It was uh, very, very gratifying. They're just people seem to like these old girls, boys. And uh, then up here on our beams are some of our other cars that we've had and built and sold and just had a lot of fun with. As you can see, we are Kind of messy a little bit once in a while, Check but look at the size of this tire. Now, that's a donut and a half. Put it next to the 19-inch Rolls-Royce one here. Look at this. This is one humongous dude. Can you imagine if that wheel ever broke loose and Ken went down the road and hit somebody? That would be the end of it. So anyway, just wanted to show you a little bit of what we're doing. This was one These of our... Are split rims. Split rims. Those are those famous uh, ones they tell you about that... One the, outer rim on the inside. One, uh, and two outer rims on the outside inside. part. What happens is that they'll come loose and they'll break loose and that'll come off when people are putting them together. It's been known to rip people in half, tear their heads off, all sorts of things. So you've got to be really, really careful with these things. We wrap them with, with uh, big heavy bandings and everything else so they can't get loose and get to us because it would kill you. There's no question about it. At least damage you to a very severe way. This will be very similar. This is one of our last ones here. 